The Philips Hue motion sensor is a great motion sensor with integrated daylight sensor. Although it is great when added to Philips Hue, it is limited in the options. A much more useful option is to integrate into other hubs like smart things, as this is Zigbee enabled. There is a magnet mount that can be placed over the majority of the case. for easy placement. Here I will walk you through how to add to Samsung Smart Things and some sample automations. Firstly, remove the battery clip and you will get a flashing orange light. Then open the Smart Things app, click the plus then Devices, and then from the top, select Scan Nearby. Once found, you can rename the device. You will then need to install what is called a custom device handler to get the hue sensor to work with smart things. I've placed the link in the description below. Firstly go to GitHub, see the link below, highlight and copy the entire script. Then you will need to go to account.smartthings.com forward slash login and sign in with your Samsung account. Under my devices, you will see your added Hue motion sensor. I have two set up. Now from the top, click on My Device Handlers. And click from the right, Create New Device Handler. Select Tab from Code. Then paste the code and at the bottom, click Create. Then at the top, you will see a button called Publish. Make sure that you click that button. And then if you go back to My Devices, Find and click on your Hue motion sensor. Click Edit. Then from the Type option, you will need to select the new Hue motion sensor from the drop-down list. You need to scroll right down to the bottom and it will be located there. And that's your Hue Motion Sensor set up within the Samsung app. Now from the app, if you scroll down and click on the Hue Sensor, you will see the motion detected, temperature and battery information. You also have a History tab. The History tab will show you motions, the temperature and the brightness in Lux.
Now I'll show you some automations I've set up. There are a few ways to set up automations. Select the menu from top left, then automations. Here I have set up some automations that when the Samsung button reaches a set temperature in the evening, some of my living room lights turn on to a set colour and brightness. You can control the colour temperature, the dimmer brightness and whether it will auto turn off. I have also set up another automation. So when the hue motion sensor is triggered in my hall, between 5 p.m. and 6.46 p.m., the living room lamp is switched on and the Google Nest thermostat changes to 19 degrees C. I've also got it to set it to only once a day, so that automation will only trigger the Nest thermostat once a day. Another way to set up smart light automations is through smart apps. Click on the menu, smart apps, then smart lighting. Here I have set up an automation so that when the room is below five lux in brightness between a set time. Turn on the lamp to a set brightness. Under the more options, you will find the option for the motion lux. If you have any questions or comments on the Hue Motion setup or automations with SmartThings, leave them down below.